Before we dive into the video, I'd like to make one quick announcement. The Superhero Bus has partnered up with online clothing outfitter Beautiful Halo. This company sells a variety of Avengers Endgame and Spider-Man Far From Home merchandise. If you're interested in any of this awesome apparel and want 30-60% to 60 off, please feel free to check out the link in the description below. What is up ladies and gentlemen? If you're new to my channel, thank you so much for checking me out. Please do not forget to give this video a thumbs up, leave a comment, subscribe, and of course hit that notification bell so you can get the latest buzz on everything comic book movie related. Should you be incredible and do all the following, we'll most definitely qualify you for giving what I'll be doing. Be sure to stay tuned to the end of the video for the rest of those details. I promise you, you won't want to miss it. In this video, I'm going to discuss a huge reveal for Avengers Endgame regarding on how Captain America returns to Soul Stone to Red Skull at the end of the movie. Need I say more? Let's dive right in. For context, the Rooster Brothers were asked about the interaction between Steve Rogers and Red Skull when he returned to Soul Stone on Vermeer in Avengers Endgame. Their response was rather surprising. They stated that once Captain America returned the Soul Stone to Red Skull, there probably wouldn't be any fight. This is due to the fact that Captain America was on a mission, and a conflict between the two would be rather pointless. It should also be noted that the Red Skull is no longer the same person from what we've previously seen in films such as Captain America the First Avenger. The Red Skull is a completely new entity, and his sole purpose is to now guard the Soul Stone on the planet Vermeer. No pun intended, but there would be no reason to fight Captain America once they encountered each other. In conclusion, the Russo brothers' answer was that they probably wouldn't fight each other, and most likely Steve would return the stone and Red Skull would just wait for his next unlucky victim. To be honest, I was really hoping to see some kind of encounter between the two in Avengers Endgame, as I found it to be a missed opportunity. But what are your thoughts on the Russo brothers' answer to this question? Sound off down below. Now, let's get into the giveaway details. I'll be giving away your choice of a Venom or Aquaman poster. And like I previously stated, all you have to do is give this video a thumbs up, leave a comment, and subscribe. The more likes and comments you leave in my videos increases your chances of winning. Well, thank you so much for tuning in. I will catch you next time.